What is going on, everybody? It's Nathan here, bringing you a Black Ops 2 commentary. And I cannot tell you how much I miss doing these commentaries. I've been able to do one in, like, the past eight or nine days because of final exams and studying and school and just other things that I've been busy with in my life. And I, I, I'm just so happy to be able to do this again. I'm on holiday break. I want to talk about that a little bit. And I also want to talk about my final exams and the new year. So, let's get this commentary started. First of all, this is my first swarm. I was so happy to get this. I've been trying for, like, the past few days to get this in the limited playing time that I have had. And I finally got it. So, I get a little bit campy when I'm on my, I'm on my uh, swarm score streak. But, I mean, wh what am I supposed to do? Like, run out there and, and just die? I, I don't know why people would, like, want me to do that. But, I do get the swarm, I get a pretty nice, like, I, I get pretty smart with it, actually. I end up sniping a guy, like, I pick up this guy's sniper, I get a pretty nice knife. But I don't want to spoil the whole thing for you, so, you guys will watch, this gameplay is just in the background, look at that knife. I forget if I'm on my streak now or not, but, anyways, so let me talk about the holiday break, everybody, uh, Christmas is coming up if you're in the U.S. or wherever, if you celebrate Christmas. I'm looking forward to it. I'm not, I'm, I got this computer mainly for Christmas, so that's kind of my main gift. I'm getting a few other things, but I'm hoping to move my, my setup once again to my room. I know I've been moving it around. This is like my second space, but I'm hopefully gonna get like a desk and a stand. I'm gonna have a nice place and just a comfortable environment to make videos because I'm in my basement right now. That's finished and everything, but I was just playing Xbox. And there's, like, a centipede, like, crawling on the floor. And I'm like, ugh. I don't want... Like, that kind of stuff doesn't happen. Like, that kind of stuff only happens in the basement. Like, one time... I'm not trying to gross anyone out here. But we had a rat, like, stuck... Like, he was in the base, Like, it was in the basement. I don't know if it was a boy or a girl. I never even seen the thing. So, I... Well, I saw it once. And I was scared for my life. I'm not, I'm not gonna try to deny it. I was scared of a rat. Okay? I don't know if it was a mouse or a rat exactly, but... Anyways, this, oh, no, I must have not been on my score streak, though. But, anyways, I was scared of this rat, and I wouldn't go in, well, I guess I went in the basement, but, like, I didn't want to stay down there my whole, like, the whole night and sleep and, like, play Call of Duty till, like, 2 a.m., like I usually do on my Saturday nights, but I didn't want to, I didn't want to do that because I'm afraid, like, I'm going to fall asleep and this, like, rat is going to be on my face. I don't know, I'm, I was scared of it, I'm not gonna try to deny it, rats, they scare me, and the weird thing is, when I was like, 11, or, I don't even know how old I was, way back in the day, well, I guess not really way back in the day, if I was 11, I was only like, three years ago, but I had a pet rat, okay, I had a pet rat, or maybe it was a mouse, I, don't, I, I cannot, okay, somebody tell me the difference between a rat and a mouse, I don't get it, but, I had one of these pet mouse or rat thingies, I don't know what it was, and my mom, my mom's gonna love this story when she watches this, she, like, okay, so we had to put, we had, like, the little ball that the thing runs around in, right? And we had to put it in the balls to clean its cage. And the thing was getting borderline to, because we had to, like, tilt the cage, just, like, animal neglect. I'm pretty much admitting it to it, but we had, had to, like, tilt the cage sideways so the mouse would, like, fall into the ball. And... My mom was like, oh, this is getting close. So we let the thing outside. Look at me knifing that guy with the combat knife. Ooh, that was a good that was a good move. And I just, I got a ghost on, so I'm like, okay, I got this guy for sure. Pick up a sniper, and you guys watch the rest. I'm getting really off topic. But anyway, so we get this rat, and we're outside. Because we're going outside because it was, we didn't want the thing to get out in our house. So I was like, oh, 10, I was like, okay. And my mom, I don't know if she let it out on purpose or what, but the thing, like, slipped out of her hand and the rat fell. She, I knew she hated the thing. Like, I, I know now, especially. But I didn't really think, she, like, she hated it before. But anyways, no, now, like, I, I miss that thing. His name was George, by the way. I named it George. I don't know why I named it George. I think I couldn't come up with anything else. And I was like, I don't know, something about George Washington or something. But anyways, so... But back on topic, winter break. I'm so excited. I needed I need this two and a half weeks off of school. I'm not sure if it's two and a half or two. Here I get the swarm. I don't even do that well with it. I'll be honest with you. I only get like six kills, I think. And I don't think I'm going to put the swarm back on. I really, I just wanted to get it just to feel like I got it. You know what I'm saying? But I'm done with final exams. So I'm able to play Call of Duty back on my regular schedule. I was basically studying all week. It kind of sucks, you know, when you're in high school having to deal with these final exams because you're busy, you know, you don't 
get the chance to have that social life for a week. You're pretty much isolated studying. And if you don't study, you're you're pretty much gonna fail. That's that's how it goes. I mean, unless you're wicked smart, you might be able to get maybe a C. I don't know. But it's gonna drop down your GPA. And the way I, I kind of think of it almost is, like, it's almost going to hurt your grade no matter what. I know I might get criticism for saying that. But really, it's hard for final exams to actually bring your grade up in high school. At least the way it is in my school, it's 20% of your grade. So, if you, like, if you have a 90, look, the final exam is like 100 and... 100 to 150 questions per subject, but basically, if you get a, like, the average, like, is like an 85, pretty much for, for the most part, but if you get that, it's gonna bring your grade down anyways, like, no matter what, if you have a 9, like, for some people it brings their grade up, I get it, but for me, I, I tend to be in the B plus, A minus, A range, but I don't know, like, I just... It hurt my grade a little bit. It brought a few of my grades down, you know, from an A to an A minus. My my mom was yelling at me, freaking out. But anyway, so I do want to thank you guys for watching. There are gonna be plenty of content coming this week, or this two and a half weeks. I'm just making videos, pumping them out because I miss doing this stuff. I really miss making commentaries. So I'm, I'm looking forward to doing it. I might make me more. Ah, I might make a few more tonight. And, yep, this video is gonna be hopefully the first of money to come. So, thank you guys for watching. Give it a like down below. Thanks. Bye.